Today we're talking all about the secret sauce of B-roll. Hello and welcome to the channel. I am Chris. This is Dirty Trucker 08. And a while back, I told a friend of mine that I would make some B-roll for one of his videos on his channel. Rob, sorry it's taken me so long to get this to you, but I'm I'm going to work on it today and you guys are going to get to come along for a little bit of the behind the scenes. Kind of a little bit of how I kind of try and come up with some B-roll for whenever I'm shooting a vehicle. Now today, what we're working on is the rat. Does it matter what kind of camera you're shooting your B roll, A roll, C roll, whatever roll on? I don't think it makes that much difference. Most cell phones would do a really good job nowadays. Hell, you can even edit on a cell phone nowadays, so it's not that big of a deal regardless. It kind of just depends on what kind of shoot you're going for. Personally, as you can see there, I like to use my GoPro for a lot of the B roll. It's just super smooth. And after I use the GoPro for a lot of that super smooth stuff, I'll go back through with my camera, which I'm using a Canon M50. And I'll usually take a lens on there that I can kind of drop the f-stop down a little bit, get that shallow depth of field, and get some more artistic shots. Start on the headlight, kind of pan down the side, or follow the depth of focus through a wheel, or something like that. But make sure your car's clean first. I gotta wipe this thing down, I completely forgot. Done. Now we can start shooting some B-roll. Now like I was saying, you kind of want to go with some angles that you can't... How do I phrase this? How was it phrased to me? One thing that I've picked up on from other videos is they try and put the camera in a place that you couldn't normally be. And I think that's why a lot of us like those super low car shot photos or B-rolls. For a couple reasons. One, it kind of reminds you of being young because it's a low angle shot so it makes it seem more youthful, possibly. Or B, it's just an angle you're not used to seeing and that makes things look different and cool. So try and take some of your B-roll from different angles that you wouldn't normally just be walking around with. And the selfie stick comes in really handy. Bad 
And something else that I think is actually kind of cool is the little detail he shots. Putting the key in the ignition, grabbing the door handle, lifting a hatch. And that's just a real quick look at how I get some of the B-roll for my shots. Hopefully you guys learned something. If you guys have different styles and techniques, please comment below. I'd love to hear what your guys are doing. Maybe I'll incorporate some of your ideas in my future videos. But until then, I want to thank you guys for watching. It really does mean a lot. I will see you next time. Thanks for hanging out. Back around, around. I'm done picking up.